What's up everyone, Phoenix Master one here, and welcome to some more Let's Play Pokemon X and Y. So in the last episode, we beat the second gym leader, Grant, and we got our second badge. So, we can now use Sprint, the HM Sprint. So we are gonna be going all the way up, because there is a TM right in this cave, and we can get to it using Sprint. So there we go. I taught it to Wake because Wake is so powerful. And there we have TM40 Aerial Ace. Pretty nice uh, flying type move if you ask me. It does not check the accuracy and it, it always hits. So we can just move this boulder as well. And let's talk to these guys. Yep. And what do you have? And we got TM21 Frustration. Awesome. So, frustration is of no use in game, but you can use it in competitive play. But anyways, now what's in here? Ah, ways more. Come on. I've already caught it. Caught it. So, I'm gonna be running away. So, now that we have completed everything in this area, we need to exit. And now we need to go to Route 10. So you can just pass through here and uh, you're at route 10. Now here we can find uh, Eevee, wild Eevees and they're not so rare but they are rare. So here we have E of Papa Berry, <laughs> funny way to say it. Anyways, so there's a psychic guy, you can use Quent here. Also there is a Thunderstone hidden in here somewhere i don't know but i know there is thunderstone somewhere so we'll be finding that and we can use it and there is another tm right there okay what how do i move it like this yep okay it's kind of like a little bit of puzzle uh maybe we need to dismount from our bike or what can go here uh, how do we do it now? Okay, just push it from here and uh, here. I should just get off my bicycle. Seriously, it's getting a nine. See if we can push this like this and there we go. We'll be having our hands on another TM, which is just past there go and we're almost there and two three there we go so we have TM 73 Thunder Wave so Thunder Wave paralyzes your opponent and there is new kind of rule in this generation and in Pokemon X and Y that you cannot paralyze electric Pokemon so it's nice and that's cool so let's go and find an Eevee here because I'll be evolving that Eevee into Jolteon and we might be able to do that thing in just this episode what the hell hold up most pass no way no way at all I'm not fighting any one of these most pass is really bulky Pokemon and it will take forever for us to defeat five of these we don't have so much time so, you can find a Gullet here, you can even find uh, Yanma here, and what do you find here? Yeah, Eevee, cool. Please be a female one, because female Eevees are super rare. Okay, it's level 20 Eevee, so I do have Rocky Helmet on Riggy, and this Eevee does no bite. So we can go for the Icy Wind, because I don't want to go for any... Uh, hard hitting move on the CD. I want to kill it because it's super rare in this area. Uh, we can go for the icy wind once again, I believe. Hopefully, it does not kick. Okay, quick attack. We'll get hurt by the. What? No. Please don't get killed. Please, EV, please stay there. Yeah, finally. Oh my god, I just feel that. This ice unit would be able to knock out this EV. So now I want to switch out because I do have the Rocky helmet. 
and uh, yeah, I don't want this Eevee to die already. So I'll switch out into Homie because Homie does not have Rocky Homie. He has Amulet Coin, and my Homie is rich as hell. Only three more levels, and our Homie will be a Charizard then. So we can cast this Eevee with a Pokeball. Hopefully, it gets in there. Let's go for this. Come on, Eevee. We got you. One. What? What's counting? Don't be so rude. So, Eevee does no quick attack. That's good. Jolteon is one of the best electric type Pokemon you can ever have because Jolteon has blazing high speed of 130 and has really nice special attack of 110. So it's really nice Pokemon to have it on your team. We don't have any status uh, inducing move or I could have just put this thing to sleep. But like I was saying Jolteon is one of the best electric types. So. It will be good to have it. And there we go. We caught it, I guess. Yep. We caught this. So we got Eevee here. Awesome. And Homie got some more points. Eevee's data is here. Eevee is like 10% in this area, I believe. So, let's find that Thunderstone. We do have the dowsing machine that that chick gave to us in the beach. So we can uh, use our... Dowsing machine here. Yep. Let's use it. Um, okay. So something is here, I guess. Is there something? Because I heard uh, some people saying that you can find Thunderstone here. And uh, in the reflecting cave, you can find another one. So if you have a Pikachu and a sweet, a Houndu, you can catch this. I'm gonna be catching it. So let's go for the takedown because takedown is a ice type move when our Ricky uses it. Because he has the ability. Whoa, a critical hit. That was too close, man. <laughs> Houndur is also pretty rare in this area, so let's catch this Houndoom, come on, come on Houndoom, because Houndoom gets a Mega Evolution and you can have Mega Houndoom, I know it, so I can later evolve it into Mega Houndoom, we caught a Houndoom, awesome, and uh, I wanna find a Golet here, and there's also uh, another fairy type Pokemon here, Snubble, which is now a fairy type, it used to be normal type, but it's now fairy type, so, yep. And, uh, now what do we have? Maybe here? What the hell? Where is that hidden item? Not find it. Somewhere in these rocks, I believe. Um, I don't know. Yep, we got revived. So it turns to red and gets crisscrossed, I believe, when it finds an item. Uh, do we have anything here? Nope. But there is a thunderstone somewhere here, hidden. I don't know, but it is here. So what do we have here now? Better be something good. Yanma Horde, man. Oof. So do we have... Does Rock Tomb hit everyone? No, Rock Slide does hit everyone, but does not hit. Rock Tomb does not hit every uh, single opponent. Rock Slide does. Whew, these hordes are annoying. Uh, can we find one? Uh... Okay, I'm I'm not having any luck. X accuracy. Ah, I sell these X items. They're useless, pointless. What do we have? Please give me something useful. Golet or something. Snubble, yeah. I told you guys that there is a fairy type here. Snubble. So we can go for the Aurora Beam because Snubble does not die so easily until unless we get a crit or something. Yeah. Okay, get hurt by my Rocky Helmet. Doggy. So now we can go for the Great Ball. This is, uh, he's in a catchable range. Or I should say she, because this is a female one. So let's go and cast this Pokemon. Yep. So we caught Snubble. 
Obviously, it's gonna get hot. Here we have. I'm gonna find Thunderstone real quick. I really don't know the location of Thunderstone, but I am pretty sure it's in here. Somewhere here. Snubble's data. Okay. If you see, Granbull is also a fairy type, and Granbull is a pretty good Pokemon. It does have really high attacking stat. So you can use it if you didn't find a Ralts, but yeah, where it is, where's the Thunderstone, uh, guess, uh, it was there, I didn't see it, it's not in a Pokeball, but it's hidden somewhere in the ground, some, someone told me that, I'm gonna be running, no more snubble action here, My god, let, can you can you guys let me find Thunderstone? Oh Howicha, the new Pokemon, it's fighting and fight fighting and flying type. So we can go for the Rock Tomb which will do the neutral damage. Aerial Ace. Okay, that's not gonna be doing anything to us. Because we are rock type of course, it does neutral damage does not kill whenever i don't want a critical hit i always get it now you guys have been seeing this and when i do competitive battling i never get the critical hits what the hell so you can go for the great ball i believe or uh uh wait this pokemon looks like something i have seen before uh if you guys know pokemon showdown there is a tier called cap which is create a pokemon so there is a pokemon like Somewhat like this, I don't know, but I seem to have been seeing this Pokemon before. Being attacked, okay, you can take all those hits. You'll be getting hurt by that Rocky Helmet though. Okay, I don't want this thing to die. I can go to... Wait, no, wait can be so... No, not be the good option. I can go to homie. Come back, Ricky. Go, my homie. I'm counting on you, my man. And uh, hopefully you can catch this thing. Roost? What? The hell are you? Are you kidding me? This thing I roost on level 20? And then this is all types of crazy stuff. I wanna go for the cut. Hopefully I don't kill this thing. Thank God. Here we are, It does not do anything to us. So we can go for the Great Ball. Because Pokeball didn't work here. So we can go and uh, hopefully catch this thing. One, two, three. There we go. We caught a new Pokemon. Yep, that's nice. I'm gonna be seeing. I want to see the stats of this Pokemon because I might even use it if it learns fly. But our Tarzad can learn fly when it evolves. So box 2, okay, I'll see the nature and the thing. Now can I please found, find a Thunderstone? And these wild Pokemon are reaching to me right now. A Molga, okay, that's something good. Um, we can go for the Ice Event. I know it's not gonna be killing this piece of Shinx nozzle. That's, that's something new. Whoa, critical hit. Paralyzed also, whoa, double hacks. I'm getting too much of the hex. I'm paralyzed as well. And uh, I wanna go for the... Uh, let's see if a quick ball can catch it. I can go for the great ball. If I'm lucky I can catch it because Anoga does have a low catch rate I believe. Uh, not sure. In black and white too I did the same. And I caught it. So it worked. What? So rude I was gonna say it worked. It has pursued now. Wow. So this sucks. And uh he died. Can go into can go into Cordelia. Maybe. Cordelia would be the good Pokemon to take on this Amiga. And hopefully you can cast this thing. For good. Come on, go for the confusion. Nozzle, this is something new. This attack is new. I want to learn about it. And it gets another 
How much are powder powder hacks? What the hell? Go for confusion. Okay, it's just in the range where we can catch it with uh, a great ball. Yep. I need to go to a Pokemon Center because Team Flare Grunt is just up ahead. Please get caught. Get. Yep. Whew. Those Amolga is annoying. It paralyzed two of my Pokemon. It got a critical hit. And it just took my time. So we caught an Amolga. Sweet. Sky Squirrel Pokemon. If Amolga got an evolution, I might have thought of using it in my team, but it didn't. So. No way, Amolga. What the hell? This guy comes. Okay, I have my rake in front, so we can easily battle this guy. So, what do we have now? Probably that Houndu. Even we caught a Houndu. What are you saying? I'm gonna be getting the Thunderstone in this episode. What, no matter what happens, I'm gonna be getting it. So, here we are. Does not look the really nice matchup for us, but I can go for the strength and do some neutral damage on this Houndu because Houndur does has really crappy defenses. Wow, it's a one-hit kill. Wake is just too powerful. And it grew to level 30. Maybe six level more and this thing will evolve. Take down. Take down, I guess. No, no, we don't want take down because Ricky already knows takedown and takedown has recoil and whatnot, so we can switch out into Cordelia. Yep, Cordelia can handle it. We have the confusion and yeah. But Golbat is really bulky Pokemon in any metagame till now. If you give it the evil light. And also it has a reliable recovery in form of boost. Whoa, Astonish did way too much critical. Oh my god. You guys are seeing. Everyone gets critical hits on me. And the Pokemon that I'm trying to catch, I do critical hits on them. Now Cordelia is dead as well. What? Cordelia lives? Wow, awesome. And we finish off this gold bat. We can leave now. Cordelia grew to level 26, awesome. And we defeated this hipster guy. So, yeah. Now let's find a Thunderstone. I wanna find the Thunderstone, no matter what. Because I wanna evolve my EV into Jolteon in this episode. Come on, get out of here. I wanna find the Thunderstone, please. You're interrupting my process. Oh my god. It is somewhere around here and there are a bunch of wild trainers here. Uh, I mean trainers with wild po no, not wild Pokemon, what am I saying? It never make any sense, what the hell. Uh, so... I'm gonna put... Uh, what can I put in front? I can put uh, homie in front. Every Pokemon is very low on health right now on my team. Please be something useful. Another one. We already caught one. We don't need you. So let's get out of here. Thunderstone, where are you? I'm finding a thunderstone and I'm not able to find one. Another team flare grunt. No, this is not good. Not good at all. Oh, a Siglet. <clears throat> Excuse me. Siglet is also pretty good Pokemon for competitive use. It has the cosmic power, it has Magic Guard as its ability, so we can go for the Fire Fang and hopefully not kill this thing. Hopefully, don't get killed, man. What the hell? Every Pokemon that I'm trying to catch, I go for the critical hit for no reason. This is getting too much, so let's cast this thing with the great ball. I never understood how thing like that could even have a gender. Now, I don't know, but should have some significant difference. So, huh, this thing is annoying us already. Kill him. Yeah, you can do that. I'll eventually catch you. 
We can go for the cut, but it might even kill this. We can go for the rock smash, as it won't be doing too much damage. As it's quite resisted by this thing, I believe. Omi is about to die. Now, please don't hit yourself. Damn it. So, one by one, everyone is getting weak. So let's go into Wake because this is the only Pokemon at full health. And uh, let's cast this with uh, Great Ball. Come on. Come in it. Please. Two, three. What the hell? This thing is annoying me now. Looks like I won't be able to find a Thunderstone in this episode. Again, confusion. Come on, Sidebeam does not confuse us so many times. Uh, what can I do? I can go for the timer ball, yes. I do have the timer ball. I can finally catch this thing. Hopefully it does not break out because it's been quite a long turn. Yep. What? What the hell? It's like 10 turn already. It's trying to whirlwind me. You. No, we can catch. We can go for another time as well. I only have like three. Already spent like two on this thing. Get caught already. Oh my god, this thing is trying just annoying me. What a pain. I have last trimal ball and I don't wanna waste this thing on this. What can we do? If I go for the Needle Arm, I'm pretty sure it will take this thing out. If I go for the Shadow Claw, this, it will take it out. Strength will be a KO. Bite will be a KO. I don't have anything to weaken this. Let's see. I'll go for my last Timer Ball and hopefully this thing gets caught. Because Timer Ball's power increase as more turns pass away. And I would just want to punch this freaking thing. Too much it's just too much I might even kill this thing I'm so pissed off but what's the point in that I'm go for the great ball here maybe catch this thing come on one two three there we go maybe yep this finally freaking thing is caught ah it took all of my time away it's already like 22 minutes episode wow Eevee grew to level 21. Nice. So, I hope this was it for this episode, guys. This thing sucked all of our time. And maybe we can find the Thunderstone in next episode and evolve our Eevee into a Jolteon. So, yeah, guys. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Till then, see ya. And I'll also fight all of these trainers which are roaming around here. So that we don't have any time of us wasted. So yeah guys, thank you guys for watching my video.